Hello everyone, in today's video, I am going to talk about 5 most popular turtle species that are widely kept as pets. So, let's start with the number one most popular pet turtle species in the whole world and that is red-eared sliders. In every pet stores that sell turtles, they will have red-eared slider. It is the number one most common, most popular uh, widely sold and bought turtle species for um, uh, pet purposes. So um, radial sliders, they can live up to 20 to 40 years and when they are adult, they can reach up to 10 to 12 inches in size. So they can get quite, uh, you know, large. Um, whenever you are buying radial slider, in most cases in the pet store, you will find a baby radial slider or a juvenile one. So those baby radial sliders uh, have a size around like two or two, two and a half inch. So they, they are very small in that stage. So you might get it uh, thinking that the turtle will not be uh, much large, but you will be very, very wrong. They can get quite large and they can live a very long life. So if you want to keep a radial slider, be make sure you can invest in a large enough tank. You can invest in a good filtration system. Uh, because even if you, you know, buy the slider uh, in its baby stage, soon it will grow and you will have to inevitably invest in a large aquarium with a proper setup. This is not only true for radar slider, this is true for most turtle species because almost all of the turtles can get quite large, they are very messy and they need a proper setup to live healthy. And again, if you want to keep a turtle, be mentally prepared that the turtle will live with you as your companion for up to 20 to 40 years. So if you are not ready for that kind of commitment, you should not get a turtle, any turtle, uh, including radial sliders. Now the feeding habit of radial sliders are very common like any other turtle species. They are mainly omnivorous, but when they are baby, they prefer to eat more meats. But as they grow older, the, their diet pattern changes and they become more omnivorous. So their diet can include, you know, um, commercial foods, chicken, meat, cooked meat, um, cooked fish, feeder, cooked fish, uh, feeder fish, uh, vegetables, stuff like that. Just, you know, remember to change up the diet a bit. Don't provide just one food. Uh, mix up things a bit. Also provide a good commercial um, food and your turtle will be happy. One last thing. The name of radial sliders has an interesting story. If you look at a radial slider, you will see a red mark beside their ear, uh, you know, in two uh, sides of the head. So from that sign, the name red ear slider actually came. Another common pet turtle species is painted turtle. Painted turtle can live, you know, around 30 to 40 years. And when they are adult, they get up to 8 inches in size. Let me tell you an interesting fact about painted turtles. They are named painted turtles because they are so colorful that they resemble an artist who has painted on their shell or on their body. So from that uh, perspective, uh, they were named painted turtles. The characteristics of painted turtles, to painted turtles and radio sliders are very, very, you know, alike. So what goes for radar sliders goes also for painted turtles. They need a large habitat. They need, you know, a variety of food with a good, com uh, good commercial food source. And they also need, you know, proper filtration. They need basking spot and all of that. So if you want to keep a painted turtle, be ready that you can actually take good, uh, proper care of the turtle. Otherwise, please just don't go to a pet store and get one because you will be soon overwhelmed by their needs. So uh, at first, do your research, know what they need, what they require, and then if you can handle that, get a painted turtle. And I'm sure you should find one in your nearest pet store. Although painted turtles are not as common as, you know, radar sliders, they are quite common and you should find one in your local pet store. The first two species that I've talked about, radar sliders and painted turtle, they are very, very alike. But the third one that I'm going to talk about now is called box turtle and this is very very different from the first two. Unlike radial sliders and painted turtles, they are aquatic turtles. Box turtles are not aquatic turtles. 
in fact box turtles actually live on land so if you want to keep box turtle you'll you don't need to set up an aquarium with water you can set up their habitat on your outside on your lawn you can make an enclosure for them or you can also keep them in an aquarium but there will be no water in it okay so box turtles are actually land turtles now uh, why they are named box turtle there is an interesting story to that when box turtles you know retract their body and goes into their shell they resemble a tightly packed box so from that you know appearance these turtles were named box turtles in america you will find uh, many many sub subspecies of box turtles like eastern um, eastern box turtle then uh, western box turtle oriental box turtle three toed box turtle so there are more uh, many many subspecies so you can uh, check out your local pet store and you should find one box turtles although they are not you know as common as aquatic turtles but you should find one and you should also find you know a local breeder there should be one in your local area if not you will have to you know look further and box turtles you know um, their feeding habitat is mostly you know, um, omnivorous they eat vegetables they also eat meat um, insects worms so other you know uh, meaty foods like that too so provide them a mixture of those things and your box turtle should be happy the next turtle on my list is map turtles map turtles can get up to you know um i would say four to ten inches in size when they're adult they can get up to eight to ten inches and they live around um around 40 to 50 years so, so they live for a long time and the name behind map turtle um, is and the reason for naming them map, map turtle is very interesting um, if you look at the shell of a map turtle it resembles like someone drew a map on their on their shell so for that reasons they were actually named map turtles um, the requirement needs for map turtles are quite similar to radius slider and painted turtle so i'll not go deep into them uh, you know if you want to keep them they are aquatic turtles so you will need a large tank a proper filtration system uh, uvb lighting setup and you will need to provide them a good uh, balanced diet with omnivorous foods like you will have to put uh, you will have to provide them with vegetables as well as meats and also a very good commercial food so if you you know take care of these basic things your map turtle should be able to live with you for around 40 to 50 years if everything is okay the next common pet turtle species is musk turtle unlike the other turtle species that i have talked about till now most of them get up to 7 to 10 inches or even 12 inches in size but musk turtles relatively stay small they don't grow beyond you know 5 to 6 inches in most cases so if you want to keep a turtle that stays relevantly small throughout its life then you should get a musk turtle Musk turtles also have many many subspecies. One uh, very common uh, and popular subspecies is Razorback musk turtle. Um, so it is an aquatic turtle um, turtle species. So the, their diet requirements and their habitat requirements will also be similar to what I have talked about till now, like red deer sliders or painted turtles. One extra thing about their diet is musk turtles actually prefer, uh, you know meat food items much more than vegetables so and in some uh, some sources also suggest that musk turtles are actually carnivorous and i would suggest you sh if you want to keep them provide them more meats like uh, live worms feeder fish you know cooked chicken stuff like that and if you want to provide them a commercial food choose one that has a higher protein percentage and if you do this your musk turtle should be happy and as they don't get you know so large so you can keep them in a relatively small tank but that doesn't mean i'm talking about a 10 gallon tank i'm talking about you know like a 45 to 50 gallon tank that should be enough for keeping a, a musk turtle throughout its whole lifespan so these are the five most total, uh, most popular turtle species that are widely kept as pets now i have an article where i have talked about 17 most popular pet turtle species if you want to know more about the other 12 species that i haven't talked about in this video i will highly urge you to check out that article i will put the link of that article in the description box below and also thank you for watching today's video in the comment uh, you can let me know on which topic i can make my next video so till then take care tata